All right, so part two, as it were, you've got your wooden trim, very minor mark there. Obviously got electric memory uh, seats, you've got your arm and card and speaker system, you've got your folding electric door mirrors. Uh, so we start driver seat wise, a uh, little bit of marking there, but again, nothing untoward. I mean, the problem is where you draw the line again, a little slight bit of wear there on either side, but certainly uh, I wouldn't do, be doing anything with that in all fairness. It's, uh, it is as it is. It's a non-smoker, non-pet car, so there's no nasty odours, nasty smells. We've got Range Rover mats in there that, in fairness, look like they've been in there uh, since day dot. Marley's now 76 uh, 422. Uh, the screen now looks fine. I'm just looking for chips. I didn't do that side. Uh, so inside, going back to inside, you've got everything there. Uh, a bit of wearing around the gear stick to be expected. Driver's armrests, slight wear there. Again, to be expected. Uh, you've got your armrest in the centre there. Yeah, nothing there, oh, nothing there around to wolf. That's on site, it's uh, one of the, certainly one of the better ones. Uh, then you're going to the rear, again, you've got your wooden trim. No rips, no tears to the back of the seat. Again, on the uh, passenger side, it's got your stitched leather. Everything there, so in fact, you've got a little cult where the uh, seat belt is. Let me just pull that out so if you can't see it from the main camera angle. So, just behind the driver's side, slight tear on the interior trim there, or where should I say? Uh, got heated seats on the back of this one. I mean, you probably could say you get away with uh, a bit more of a clean to the seats uh, again, rear mats. Uh, Underneath, not used, got a little mark on the uh, door, internal door wheel arch, if you like. Slight bit of wearing on the driver's door, internal thing down here as well. Inside, got your parcel shelf in situ. Uh, in fact, I need to open this properly. Uh, again, nice clean car to be fair, so there's no dogs, no pets, no nasty odours, you've got your wheel brace, spare wheel, uh, sorry, uh, jack, etc. All in there, it's 40 60 split on the rear seat, you've got your you've got a battery point there if you want to put your fridge in the back. Uh, so this is dry passenger side rear door. Again, the little mark there, just on the uh, where the seat belt gets uh, gets caught. But yeah, nothing there. And to all bit of dirt around there, because I could do a little bit of a clean inside. To be fair, which I can obviously do. Uh, a little mark on the lever on the rear of the driver's seat. Uh, but yes, I don't think this will uh, disappoint. Very small mark on the uh, trim there on the door. Oh, sorry, let's just do. A little mark on the uh, inside wheel arch is moving down, but certainly not uncommon. Then we're jumping the driver's side. And, uh, sorry, passenger side. So passenger seat obviously doesn't always have as much wear, obviously, for obvious reasons. So again, you could have a bit more of a clean, I would say, but again, generally in, uh, in good order, armrest in good order. Again, mats throughout. So, yeah, I mean, I, I can't really go uh, in much more detail, to be honest with you. Um, so, what it's... Uh, let me just shut this door. So, it's been serviced. I've come with a new MOT. We've obviously spoken quite a lot of detail about the history. I'll get your badges put on. I'll get some shadow grey badges put on for you. Uh, if it's so many want to come along and collect, which is take a deposit on uh, in advance, obviously we get the badges ordered, get the MOT done for you, uh, so it's ready to drive away Saturday. If for any reason you get in Saturday and you go, 
Robert, you miss something or I've done something that doesn't quite, uh, or you see something that doesn't quite float your boat as it were, then we'll just refund your uh, refund your deposit. And uh, but I generally don't think we're going to have an issue. I mean, the reason I'm doing this video is to be as open, as transparent as possible. Um, and the car is what it is. So uh, in my opinion, I've seen uh, many a Range Rover, uh, which has been abused and well used. Uh, the fact we've got the history on this one for the last uh, five years or so is a great, uh, great help uh, with answering your questions, really, uh, the joint arms, etc., wishbones, etc. So uh, anyway, for me, for now, I think we're done. I'll get these, uh, I'll get these over to you and let me know what you're thinking. Cheers.